Aloha, and welcome to the Teacher Portfolio and Preparation Series, or TIPS for short. This professional learning series, offered by the National Foreign Language Resource Center at the University of Hawaii at Manoa, is specifically designed for graduate students in language departments at U.S. universities. And the majority of examples and resources discussed will focus on that area though we also sometimes touch on the field of literature since it is related. That being said, graduate students in other fields may still find tips to be very helpful, but will need to seek out their own discipline-specific resources and examples. The goal of the tip series is twofold. First, it will help you build a teacher portfolio. And second, it will help prepare you for the job market you will face upon graduation. TIPS was originally founded in the year 2000 by Kenton Harsh and me, Jim Yoshioka, and since then was offered twice a year as an in-person workshop series for graduate students in the former UH Manoa College of Languages, Linguistics, and Literature. Co-facilitators and co-curriculum designers for the TIP series have included Emily Lee and Priscilla Fawcett. Because we have received great feedback from UH students over the years on how helpful the TIP series is, we have decided to update its materials and expand its reach by offering tips as a collection of free online TED-Ed lessons. We wish to offer our thanks to the National Foreign Language Resource Center for its support of this project, which has resulted in eight modules with a total of 19 lessons. One important note, we facilitators want to emphasize that the strategies and advice given in TIPS are specifically done with the U.S. context and job market in mind. If you are applying for jobs in another country, please be aware that there will be different cultural expectations, which you should research, and the tips contained here may not apply for those situations. So what exactly will we be focusing on in tips? In module one, we will discuss what teacher portfolios are, what they contain, and how to put one together, and give an introduction to electronic or online portfolios. Module two will focus on the important two-part process of conducting a job search and a follow-up information search to help find a position that will be a good match for you. In module three, we will explore how to develop a philosophy of teaching statement and avoid common problems people make when writing them. Module four centers on creating an effective curriculum vita, or CV for short, both master and tailored versions, and overcoming potential CV pitfalls. In module five, we examine how to craft effective cover letters and dodge common cover letter mistakes. Module six encourages you to collect and write up artifacts or evidence of your teaching for your portfolio to document and then showcase your teaching. In module seven, we will cover a wide variety of interview tips and strategies, including how to prepare beforehand and what particular considerations you should keep in mind when doing a video interview. Finally, Module 8 has you bring together all the items for your portfolio and then delves into particular strategies for building an online teacher portfolio. The final lesson of Module 8 is optional and for those wishing to earn a digital badge for the TIP series, which will involve some extra tasks beyond the 19 lessons. See the final lesson or the TIPS website for more information. The new tip series was designed for self-study, with all main content and resources available in our TED-Ed lessons and on the TIPS website. You can go through all eight modules and their associated TED-Ed lessons at your own pace. Each TED-Ed lesson has four sections. Watch, where you will view a video on the lesson topic. Think, where you can quiz yourself on what you've learned. 
Dig Deeper, which contains further information and resources on the topic, and Discuss, which will pose a question or task to respond to in the discussion board. We recommend taking the modules in order since they build upon one another, but you are also welcome to create your own order for study depending on your needs. In general, it is up to participants to build their portfolios and job application materials on their own with the information and strategies provided. But there will be opportunities for feedback and interaction in the lesson discuss forums. If you complete all watch, think, dig deeper, and discuss activities in each module's TED Ed lessons, you should achieve the 10 learning outcomes listed here and on our TIPS website by the end of your self-study. The activities and posts in the discuss section are particularly important because they have you apply the knowledge you've learned. Speaking of the TED Ed Discuss sections, we wanted to take a moment to remind our users to follow proper netiquette. Please treat fellow discussion forum participants with respect in all online comments. Review and edit your post before posting. Do not swear or make personal insulting remarks. Keep caps lock at a minimum because otherwise it makes you look like you are yelling. Be careful when using humor or sarcasm as much can be lost in translation and give offense in an online environment. Postings that do not follow our netiquette guidelines will be removed. For many, the eight modules and their TED Ed lessons will be all you need to get you started on the road to your teacher portfolio and that job you want. For those of you who are more ambitious or want additional opportunities for feedback as you develop your portfolio, we recommend the TIPS digital badge route. For nominal fee and by completing a number of specified teacher portfolio items and reflection tasks, you could earn a TIPS digital badge. Badge seekers would also have access to our TIPS Discord community. There you can ask questions or make postings in the appropriate channel, modeled after the eight modules, and get replies and feedback from other TIPS community members. TIPS facilitators will also participate regularly as time permits. More details about the TIPS digital badge and Discord community are provided in the final TED Ed lesson and on the TIPS website. Whatever path you take, we hope that you will find the insights and strategies discussed in the eight modules to be helpful as you build your portfolio and apply for that job you have your eye on. Welcome to TIPS.